not been to the grocery store in I think a week. My hair is a mess. I haven't brushed it. I haven't stepped foot out of the house. I literally could not even bring myself to take out my recycling and compost last night. I was genuinely this close from ordering Uber Eats again today, but I think I'm going to drag myself outside, go to the grocery store, at least get some fruits and veggies and try to attempt to be a healthy, wholesome human being. as I thought. I'm literally about to make my bed for the third time today because I keep um, getting back in and messing it up. So I realized that the reason I don't have energy is because I didn't have any caffeine today. Here's the finished product of my frozen pizza. I also made some arugula salad with olive oil, lemon, and parmesan, and my matcha latte. To be fully honest, I am a little bit disappointed <laughs> in this because I had a bite of this and it was just a little bit underwhelming but I mean what did I expect? It's okay, it's just one of those days where I just don't feel like cooking at all and usually I would cook myself something really nice when I'm feeling down but I'm just so lethargic today. I'm gonna try to spice it up with some hot mustard. At least I have this because this is actually really good. It might look like I have set up my couch so that I can spend all my time on here. And um, I gotta say that's pretty much what I did. I just kind of like threw in the towel, brought my yellow blanket out here, and I'm just chilling here permanently. <sighs> Anyways, I have this mango and it has not been ripening. It is green and I want to eat it but it is literally hard as rock and I don't know what to do I don't know if I should like keep it warm or something or put it in the sun I am actually having a pretty good day productivity wise on point very proud of myself today because I completed a bunch of huge projects lately and I feel like I deserve to celebrate. Definitely needs to be a bit more chill, but I've tried a lot of Rieslings and this is like really good. Um, I'm currently getting ready to go out to a cafe. I thought since it's Friday, I'm going to treat myself to some cafe coffee. 
and um, work there. I find that I'm a lot more productive since I'm not at home. I can't just I can't just go back into bed or lie on my sofa. if I just cut off the sleeves um, so that's more of like a sweater vest type situation and then if I use this elastic to tighten the waist a bit Get ready to leave the house soon. for the first time like I guess it was like a first date type of thing so I go and he kind of stood me up so I was like very confused not sure what was going on the um the bartender or the the server or whatever he literally came up to me and gave me a shot because he was like um I guess he felt bad for me. <laughs> he was like, you got stood up, so here, I'll take a shot with you. <laughs> and it was actually really, really wholesome. Like, that was really cute. But yeah, so that was my night. Um... <laughs>
the bad news is that I did not get the hand soap. But the good news is that I got a bunch of other stuff for the house. I got some fresh eucalyptus from my favorite florist in Montreal, Dragon Flower Shop. And then I went to Annex Vintage and got this really nice Japanese cypress incense. Like, look how fancy this is. So pretty. And I also got these terracotta tapered twisted candles. So got this little placemat. Such a cute pattern for my wood table because I always like get oil and water on it, which you're not supposed to do. And I hope that this will help protect it. So yeah, for the price of one Aesop hand soap, I got all this stuff and this. This is so good. Ah! <coughs> Find something to do To keep yourself on the back When the world gets mad What you gonna do? You're not young anymore It's honestly true